was on vacation in France on a river cruise and we were touring these little towns and by the end of the afternoon walking up and down cobblestone streets, my knees were toast. So the doctor had always said, you'll know when, you're, when it's time and I knew. Well, I had bilateral knee replacements. I have the sports model knees that gives me a little bit more flexibility in the knee. If patients did not have rehab after joint replacement, they wouldn't have good outcomes. They just can't do everything that they need to do on their own and have a full recovery. They offer you no slack. You're out of bed the next day. So you're up and walking right away. If you don't have the rehab post-surgery, then you become sedentary and then you have pain and then you don't feel like getting up, you don't feel like moving, and then you don't make any progress. So they, they threw in some things for me specifically, I think, related to getting back on the tennis court. There's a little skip drill, and I used the bungee cord, like making a tennis stroke, so I would skip into the shot and then skip back. So it's just kind of finding out why they had this surgery. It's pretty much an elective surgery, be it from pain or activity that they want to get back to, and talking about that and where they want to be. So first establish that trust, and then we just go and ask them what, what they want to do. What was their whole um, reason for having this surgery? So we played a little bracket game that we invented and that was good for just moving around. You didn't really have to think about it because you were focused on it. Just like tennis, you're focused on the shot. You're not thinking about the movement. We want to work it from the process of when they come in so they know what they're doing, what to expect from the therapy, um, set some goals for them, and then take them through inpatient, outpatient physical therapy, and back to the tennis courts or where they might want to be. The University of Maryland Rehab Network has been really wonderful for Upper Chesapeake to be a part of because it allows us to collaborate with other professionals across the system in all of the specialty areas. The most important thing we have as rehabilitation professionals is the people that provide that service. So when a patient comes in to any one of our clinics, they really are working with people that have had specialized education and have really had that ability to network with other people across the system and other therapists across the system who really want the best for their patients. The fact that physical therapy is here and if there were any issues that they could immediately go back to the doc, there's kind of a singular medical record, all that creates a more seamless situation between doc and therapist. which. I think is important these days. I'll play tennis as long as I can play tennis. So with the knees, hopefully that will be extended now.